Yeah, what's well, going, everyone? Sanju Chie here. So this is somewhere we haven't been on this channel <laughs> in a while. The Boruto anime, episode two hundred and eighty-two, which marks the start of the Boruto anime doing its adaptation for the Sasuke Retsuden novel. And of course, we're almost three hundred episodes in. That's crazy to me. The Boruto anime, I like. I never like imagined will be hitting these numbers honestly speaking because you know going coming into the Borto side of the franchise we never really expected it would be going on this long so it is what it is but anyway yes most of you know i haven't completed the funato clan arc the last episode i watched or even reviewed on this channel was episode 235 and i just fell off after that because it just i just lost interest completely <laughs> and i've been saying for months that i'll catch up but as it stands the plan right now is going forward, we'll be bringing back Boruto Naruto Next Generation episode reviews and reactions starting with this episode going forward, especially since the code arc is starting next month, so definitely want to catch that. But in my spare time, I'll, you know, catch the Funata clan arc in my spare time and I'll probably do some community posts on it, you know, or making fun of it, whichever it is. <laughs> so. It is what it is. I know some person who might say I might not have to go back and watch those episodes, but for completion is sick, so it is what it is. But anyway, Sanjay Uchiha here, guys. The Uchiha that Itachi forgot that joined YouTube. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having an awesome new year so far. And I'm looking forward to, you know, diving into more Boruto and Naruto with you guys. So leave a comment. Let's start a discussion. Leave a like. Subscribe naturally. Let's see if we can at least get to 2,000 subscribers before the end of January. And let's get into it. Mm-hmm. Yes, girl, you get the ring, you get the ring, yes, yes! <laughs> Sasuke's like, <laughs> locals. Alright, so the problem I find most persons are concerned when it comes on to the Naruto or Boruto anime doing like adaptations of the novels, it just seems like it cuts out so many details. And compared to the manga so far, it feels that way. Kinda blending in the stuff with Kara into this interesting not gonna lie i do like the soundtrack so far i don't know some words just seem kind of fast piece read nigga read so characters i don't really care about you know there's something i forgot to mention like I, I I think I want to theorize that a lot of these people are actually just going to die before the time skip. Yo! Mm hmm Best girl! Oh, Asian Kung Fu Generation, nice! <laughs> Alright. Sometimes I know openings can, you know, take liberty and say, Yo, the characters are doing this, this, and this! Fighting these people and that, that never really happens, but it just seems so funny to see these characters, you know, lined up against like, you know, Ida and Kuhn and it's, it's ridiculous. But I'm curious to see how they'll be incorporated in the anime version of the code arc, because clearly they'll be expanding on things based on the opening at least. <laughs> why is this one? Why, why is this man just smiling now? He's like, yo, finally! Fresh meat! <laughs> now we can do this the easy way or we can do it the hard way. The choice is yours. <laughs> it's, <laughs> like, it's just a look for the mud piece, honestly. <laughs> Marriage fraud? Seriously? <laughs> Bro, clearly you don't know me. I am literally, li well, I used to be the second strongest person on the planet. <laughs> I respect dog, but they need a fuck. Once I feel my badness. The way that it's censored just looks odd to me. <laughs> Yo, Sasuke just looks so bored, bro. Why do I feel like? Let like them could at least show us him use the, the, the earth. <sighs> okay. And then money with a win snake and not that easy. <laughs> I came a loody. <laughs> Alright, so the action here now. Mm -hmm. 
However, Genjutsu doesn't work, son. Yeah. Sasuke! Yeah. No wounds are regenerated, dog. Alright! One said, no, bro, this is Boruto, dog. Regular Sharingan don't work here. <laughs> well, shit. They, he, but he didn't explain why, why it did work. This is so odd, bro. Of course, Kakashi. Manuscript of six parts. Wow, it's just like. <laughs> All right, so that was episode 282, and again, we are finally back to covering the Boruto anime. And honestly, as... <sighs> well, I think this episode has its pros, its positives, its, 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 its benefits, I suppose. I think some of the concerns that may have been floating around in the community I think this episode for the most part kind of proves it now of course if you're a Naruto or Boruto fan or someone that's kind of up to date with the franchise or keeping up with it you know that Sasuke Ritsuden this same story is originally a novel that has recently been adapted to manga formats and more recently with this episode well into the anime the Boruto anime specifically and to be honest i hate to be that guy but so far based on what i've seen the manga did it better <laughs> like, like, like seriously the manga did it better but anyway let's kind of go it over so episode 282 of course the beginning of sasuke retsuden and of course the whole premise revolves around naruto having somewhat of an illness a chakra illness that the sage of six pants also experienced and of course it's learned that he actually found a cure and recovered within the land of radaku where we have sasuke and kakashi infiltrating at the moment kind of attacking things from two different you know routes two different you know paths to actually find the information on said cure to help naruto out and to be honest, I think like ever since I've been hearing about the novel and you know I've been reading the manga adaptation, it's an awesome premise. Of course, it features characters that most persons are invested in. I mean, Sasuke, Kakashi, Naruto. It does establish stakes in the sense that you know, you know, Naruto's life is in danger, but at the same time, because of its placement in the series, we know that Naruto isn't going to. I mean, obviously he's still alive, so they obviously are going to succeed. So I guess that does take away some of the, um, I guess, tension for the most part, especially since when it comes on to the anime, they're, you know, framing it as a flashback. So we know one way or another, by the end of this, Sasuke or Kakashi are both will succeed in, you know, getting Naruto the cure. So premise wise, I think the whole story is, is awesome. And when it comes on to journeying to this land of Radaku, when it comes on to the world building that, you know, the Boruto side of the franchise focuses on, I would say, a lot. Or at least it gives the vibe of that, or tone of that. You know, that's another plus or positive that I like. It's like, land of Radaku, where was this before? <laughs> so, you know, that's the good part about it. Now, in terms of this episode, I definitely like the music, the OST choice like it really just sells this this far away foreign land that's in you know famine and it's just in a turmoil it, i don't know something about the ost really helps to sell the vibe of you know this whole mini arc this adaptation of you know sasuke retsuden so i definitely love that and uh, i mean art and animation wise it's just average art and animation i'm crazy <laughs> but as I was saying in the beginning there, it, like, the manga just did it better. There's just something about watching this episode in comparison to reading the manga. And that's just the piercing I feel. 
it's a bit more fast paced than the manga, honestly speaking. And the fact that they're incorporating the Kakashi side of things, which is to be expected because, you know, they're all in the land of Radaku and the whole plot lines between Kakashi's side of the mission and Sasuke's side of the mission, they are kind of intertwined in one way or another as, you know, we have the observatory where the prison is and we have the prime minister who is kind of overseeing things in the capital where Kakashi is, you know, handling things there. So obviously there is going to be some link between the observatory and like the capital. So it's like, yeah, it's expected them for, I guess, in at least for the anime, for them to kind of intertwine or, or link, you know, Kakashi and Sasuke on screen. But it just seems overall fast paced to say the least. It's kind of like, yeah, we get the details, we're getting into it. And it's not that the manga didn't do something similar, but the manga just seemed like it took its time to you know, transition Sasuke going into the prison compared to how the anime is doing it. And the knowledge that the code arc is starting in February, granted we don't have a date, but based on the piercing and that knowledge of the code arc starting in February, it seems like the adaptation for this story in the anime is going to suffer as a result in one way or another. There are little tidbits here and there I see that they left out in comparison to the manga at least and it might sound like nitpicking which maybe it is but I'm just saying it, it to me stuff like that is an indication that yeah we, we are kind of just it, it's somewhat of an abridged uh, uh, version of the story arc you know or at least that's the vibe I get from this episode I mean I know it's simple things like Sasuke in the prison they don't show him using the earth style to craft the diamond um the diamond to you know bet against GG and his cellmates um of course they don't show sasuke in redaku like before going to prison compared to the manga there's that left out and the fact that we're incorporating kakashi's side of the story as well is like it just gives this whole rushed feeling if you're asking me so yeah and it's kind of like what I was thinking before, that when it comes down to the anime, whether it be Naruto or Boruto, so it's not just a Boruto thing. To me, and for the novel readers who are watching, you can correct me if I'm wrong, but the vibe I get when it comes down to the Naruto anime or the studio period adapting the, 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 the novels into anime form is like, it just gives me the vibe, the feeling that they're just not doing an awesome job at it like it seems like it's just mm, it just feels kind of a bit rushed the piercing seems a bit faster and the reason why i don't like this and this might be a personal thing is that again it comes down to the dynamic or the relationship between the boruto anime and the manga yes there's plan to do the code arc Yes, we're gonna get that this year, fine. But in the grand scheme of things, we're still close to the manga. Like, anime, you know, compared to the manga, I think the last chapter was, what, 76? This month, we're getting chapter 77. Once the code arc starts, we'll be covering chapter 55. We'll be starting there and going forward. And it's like, I'm thinking, we don't have to rush adapting uh, this novel. Like, we could probably get two to three months like, and especially if we're really incorporating the Sasuke stuff, the Kakashi side of the novel, well, Kakashi's novel as well in Rodaku, we don't have to rush it. <laughs> Honestly, we could do like two to three months of this and, you know, it doesn't have to be like rush it, rushing through it in one month. So it's like, ugh, jeez. Because granted, as I was saying in my, you know, my Boruto 2023 expectations and predictions video, yes, I'm expecting them to kind of pad out and add additional content to the code arc, you know, adapting chapters 55 to 70 something, which, whichever number they'll end the code arc at in the anime. But it's like when you have other material you can adapt that persons would enjoy, would want to see, and it does bridge the gap to... What I always say, you know, content that persons want to see, balance that with, you know, having the source material build up is like, when we actually get to the material, because for, for a while I've been saying, you know, the board anime could just adapt novels, or even when towards the tail end of Shippuden, they could have just adapted a bunch of the novels instead of doing all of that infinite Tsukuyumi filler. 
And it's like when we actually get to doing what I'm suggesting is like we do it in a rush way and we go back to the original problem of the Boruto anime having to pad things out with a lot of things that persons don't necessarily want to see in the grand scheme of things or at least stuff that persons want to see but it's so dragged out it's like ugh, you lose interest so yeah but all in all it was i think this is still a decent start for the anime's version of the arc definitely the piercing is a bit off-putting to me but eh, and it just just reminds me of the you know the recurring problem i find with the boruto anime if i'm being honest but honestly music ost in terms of the premise of the story seeing sasuke in the prison in in a setting that we're not used to seeing him in and of course them kind of tying it in with his well i haven't watched boruto anime in a while but his hunt for i guess surviving kara members i think that's nice at the very least it kind of the, the the whole long dragged out stuff that the anime might have done it still finds ways to make the viewers feel that it was worth watching it by tying it into material that didn't originally consider or give thought to include that so essentially of course novel wise or <laughs> novel wise or the manga adaptation wise there was no mention of course of oh Sasuke thinking back to oh like I'm searching for car members let me think back to that time of Rodaku no but anime wise of course they have to it makes sense to you know factor that in and kind of blend it in with adapting this material so it is what it is all in all it's still still fun and nice to be back to covering the Boruto anime despite my criticisms concerns which I think are you know warranted but it is what it is thanks for tuning in i hope you guys are having an awesome day of course leave a comment leave a like let me know your thoughts on sasuke Ritsuden. and if you read the manga let me know if you think the manga did it better so yeah i think so so it is what it is anyway this video should be going up on monday um yeah so i should get some sleep for work <laughs> anyway stay safe people i'll see you in the next one Bye.